But I want to talk to y'all about, I don't know. Okay. So I wanted to make a video as to why I've been MIA, essentially. Like I've tried to record this a couple times and like it just doesn't, I just talked way too much. I've only done this twice. But I think the essence of the other video was me just kind of sifting through my thoughts and like having a lot of them and feeling like I can't speak. That's what this video is about. I feel like I can't speak and I don't know why. Well, I do know why. It's cause like I'm changing and like a, there's a lot of moving parts, a lot of moving parts. Like <laughs> my life is just like, I feel like, like life is happening and I'm in it, I'm experiencing it, but like I'm avoiding certain shit and like I'm trying to navigate through shit, but like it's hard. I feel like that's everyone's life. It's nothing special, but because stuff is like happening and I'm changing and my life is changing and like everything doesn't always add up, I feel like I can't speak on that. And that's no way to feel. And I know that, but I do. And I feel blocked. And I feel like I'm blocking myself. We all have an idea of how we think life should go and the route that we should take. And when stuff comes our way, it's like, it's hard to know what you're deflecting and what you're avoiding. And deflecting to me is like something coming and bouncing off and you're like not even, you're not dealing with it because you don't need to deal with it. But avoiding is like, <laughs> you know you have to deal with it and you're like, eh, I don't wanna deal with it. Like, and I've been avoiding, I've been avoiding. And mainly I've been avoiding like my wedding. And I was gonna say marriage, but I'm not really avoiding marriage just in the traditional sense of what marriage is. Like, I am different, <laughs> which, is, which is a vague statement and isn't, doesn't separate me from anybody else. But like my views on marriage and tradition and even religion are different. And I feel like because it doesn't assimilate with everybody else, it's hard to speak on it. But it shouldn't be because different isn't bad. It's just different and we're all different. <laughs> but yeah, so like I've been avoiding speaking on how I feel about certain topics. Like I don't want my fiance's last name. Good, bad, or indifferent. At the stage I'm in my life right now, like I don't feel like us having the same last name means we're married. Like. The idea of marriage, just in general, is so much deeper than a last name, than a piece of paper, than any of that. And it's like, even a ring, like it's all superficial. It's, it's superficial. <laughs> and so it's hard to speak out on things that you think are superficial, but you're like in it, you're living it, you know? Like him being in the NFL is superficial. Like not saying that it's good, bad, or indifferent, but like you get a perception of it and like, I'm not superficial, he's not superficial. Life, our life isn't superficial, it's real. And like there's good, there's bad, there's ugly. And I feel like we're not always able to speak on it because of fear of judgment. And it's been very hard for me to like know that and then act on it. And like I guess me making this video, if I post it. <laughs> if I post it. <laughs> But like, like, it's just, it's like acknowledging that and like not avoiding. Cause like I've been avoiding so much, like so much and like trying to keep it together. And not even in like a, a wild or crazy way, but it's just like, it's hard to be transparent when you're going through shit. And I feel like everybody can relate to that, you know? So yeah, I haven't been here for a while, like mentally, <laughs> physically on YouTube, like the spiritually, like it's just, we're just working through some shit. You feel me? <laughs> I gotta see what I said in this video.
But yeah, um, it's been what? Six minutes? Six minutes? I look so cute. I'm gonna get really, really good at like being a snarky little bitch. Cause I like it sometimes. 